Hi, welcome to my channel. Let's have some fun here and don't forget to subscribe and like. Okay, for the first round, we have a magic ring. This is how I do a magic ring. And we pull up a loop and pull through this one. So, for first row, we have eight single crochet in this magic ring. and the last and we take it like this and the slip stitch and the first single crochet wow. okay for the second row we have one double crochet on each stitch and three chain between every two um, double crochet. So for the first double crochet, I use this tick. Look, we pull, pull it up and round the hook. And I go into the first stitch, take a yarn and this. Pull through two and pull through two. It's not too hard, but a little chain three, double crochet in the next stitch, chain three, double crochet in the next stitch, at the end of the row chain three and a slip stitch in the both loops we take both loops and slip stitch okay for the round three we have chain one and exactly into the space and we have four single crochet here and three no stitch around the double crochet just into the space and four single crochet in each space four again one two three and four we do this for whole round and at the end of the row, slip a stitch in the first single crochet. In, in this round, we have eight group of single crochets. That in every group, we have four single crochet. In the first single crochet, we have two double crochet. But in the next three single crochets, we have only one double crochet. So for the first double crochet, I used the technique before. Another double crochet again in the first stitch. So one double crochet in the next three double single crochet. Okay, we're going into the next group. In the first one, we have two double crochet. One, two. And in the next three, we only have one. Again, in the first two double crochet, one, two, 
in the next three only one double crochet and do this for her round so round four we are position the first double crochet and chain one and single crochet in the first double crochet and we have 13 chain here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 and uh, a single crochet in the fourth chain from the hook 1, 2, 3 and 4 Okay, we have three chain. We made a picot. And look, we take these two and the slip stitch. Single crochet in the next chain. Again, a picot with three chain. Always take two and the slip stitch. Again, single crochet in next chain. Look. Chain three. And make it picot. And another picot. Again, one, two, three. There's a point here, that's why I take the whole the whole thing I do. So we take we have four picots here. After that, in the next two chain, we made a single crochet. Look, one and two. So again, we repeat this process here. One, two, three, a picot. One single crochet in the next chain, picot. Single crochet in the next chain. Picot and single crochet in the next chain and picot. This is the last picot here. We have one chain left. We single crochet here. And look what we do. There is a first double crochet here. We throw it like this. I don't know how I can explain it in English. I'm not very good in English. But we take this. We do it like this. And pull it up. until we have two double crochets uh, behind the double crochet so we take the yarn and the first space we made here we go into the space, the first space and a slip a stitch easily look at the view perfect so we have five single crochet next. One. Look, this the what this was the first that we made before, and this is the next one. One. Two. Three. And four. And five. So if you notice, 
if we we have two double crochet in the first single crochet in every group in the first double crochet when we reach the first double crochet we make something like this so again we have 13 chain and we do this exactly like what we did here and we do this for her round and um, this kind of stitch that uh, I call it special X stitch I don't know we do this for every double crochets and five single crochets after that so I do it and I come back this is it became like this and I do my last special stitch so and at the end of I have four single crochet I made single crochet first and I do my last four single crochets and slip a stitch in the first single crochet we made it's like this okay now we we'll go for round six. Chain one and two single crochet, one single crochet in the first stitch, and then we have a firm post single crochet up up this is special stitch. Look. I take this and this I skip one single crochet and single crochet next to chain four I skip one and two one single crochet in each of next two single crochet and again a single crochet at the top of this special stitch that would that we take two single crochets here together and do our single crochet again two single crochet we have one single crochet in next two and chain four chain skip one one single crochet in next two again This is like this. Okay, at the end of the row, I skip one and I single crochet one and position the first single crochet I made. Okay, I'm done. Look. Now chain one, single crochet in the first stitch. Okay, now we have a uh, popcorn around this double crochet right here and I do my popcorn with uh, the four times here and over and then I do my stitch. Okay. I do it five times for my popcorn. After five stitches, I make my popcorn. Oops. and oops <laughs> double oopsie and oh my god okay and after that 
in the next two stitches we have one single crochet Oh yeah, now we reach the chain four spaces, two single crochet in the chain four space. We have another popcorn here around these two double crochet. I do my popcorn with triple uh, stitch. I take this two yard, one from the first, two second from the second double crochet and do my stitch two and I do my popcorn and again in the space behind it I crochet two more single crochet one single crochet in the next two stitches and again we have a popcorn around exactly like this around this pop uh, double crochet here I yarn over four times and do my stitch around this double crochet which is between the special stitch and this is like this and uh, yes this is uh, for her round and at the end of the row I do a slip stitch in the first single crochet for round eight, chain one, single crochet in the first single crochet. We skip every uh, popcorns. We have four uh, stitches between every popcorn, so we do a single crochet on the every uh, stitches around this part. Okay, round nine, uh, pa uh, a slip a stitch in the first of the row, in the stitch of the row, and single crochet in the first stitch, chain three, a skip one stitch, and single crochet in the next stitch. Again, chain three, a skip one, single crochet in the next. This is what we do in this round, simple, isn't it? This is like this. We do this for whole round. At the end of the row, except of chain three, we have a double crochet in the first stitch. And now chain one, single crochet exactly in this space we make, and chain three single crochet in next space, chain 3, single crochet in next space. This is the exact the same as the previous round. Previous row. <laughs> okay, do this. And now um, for round 11, chain 1 and single crochet in every spaces we have three single crochet in every space let's keep the single crochets and do only in the spaces one two and three this is what we do in this round that's it Okay, this round, chain one, single crochet in the next single crochet, which is the 
centre single crochet. Eleven chain. Skip five single crochet, single crochet in the next one. Again, eleven chain. Skip five single crochet and single crochet in the next. This is what it looked like. Okay, now in every uh, spaces we have eleven single crochet. We have no crochet around the single crochet only. In the spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's keep this. Single crochet and again eleven single crochet in this space. Okay, now <laughs> after a slip stitch, I go um, behind. I go behind a uh, uh, back post the slip stitch around the single crochet below okay and now I slip a stitch in the next two stitches right here. One and two. Chain one and single crochet in the next one. Chain eleven exactly like we did before in the next uh, look I um, comb it over this is the chain and I take it back and I do my single crochet in the center of this group of single crochets look in the I pull it all front of the uh, and single crochet and again this is the center one in this group chain 11 again and for the next I take it front the end do my single crochet again 11 chain and I take it back and do my single crochet look what it looked like I don't know how to explain it I just can show it to you how I do this round and 
Okay, let's see this is the first single crochet. This is what we do here, and for next round, exactly like we did before, we have 11 single crochet in the spaces. We only do crochet in the spaces. We skip the single crochets between, and we have 11 single crochet in every 11 chain. Like here, and I go exactly straight on the next space. This is like this, and this is our final product.